Today on Black Pyramid Shooting. Today on Black Pyramid Shooting. Time out. Time out. Time out. Several months ago, I was filming a Flintlock female fun video with Rachel. Brand new shooter, showing her how to use a smoothbore and shooting action on video. And had a pair of eye protection glasses laying right there on the table and forgot to ask her to put them on. And quite a few of you let me know about that. Whew. And therefore, that's great because, because now I'm more safety conscious and I have modified every video since then to remind you of ear protection and eye protection. Except for this one. We both know that glasses are not worn in the video. It was filmed back in November, two months before we filmed the Rachel video. And I really can't change that part now. But it's such a fun video, I really didn't want to delete it. I think you guys will really, really enjoy this one. Especially if you like college basketball. Enjoy the battle of the Kentucky Rifles and have a blessed day. Today on Black Pyramid Shooting, I gotta be nuts. Yes, it's Saturday. I'm in eastern Kentucky going down some of the crookedest roads in the state that you could imagine. Heading down to my buddy Steve's house with an almost 100% chance of rain today. We're going to do a little bit of shooting, barn style. Hey folks, we're here in Kentucky today. It's winter time, it's cold, it's nasty. Most people are inside watching basketball, probably college basketball. We're gonna do something a little different here today. Instead of being in a gym, we're in a barn. And we're gonna have the Battle of the Kentucky Rifles, folks. It's gonna be exciting, stay tuned. In today's matchup, we have over there as the visiting team from Louisville, Kentucky, the Louisville Cardinals. Introducing our home team. This is your University of Kentucky Wildcats with the Kentucky Rifle. We're on board first. Oh, he missed. Oh, no. Louisville's up for one. Shoots again. I'm up by seven points. Yes! Louisville's back up on top. Six points on top. Can oh, no! Three Kentucky points. thinks they can shoot the three. We can, too. Oh, no! And rebounds. Louisville gets the ball. Oh, no! In your face, Kentucky. Slam dunk. Yes, I'm catching up. Ten seconds to go before the half. Kentucky's trying to get back, trying to catch up. Can they do it, folks? <laughs> no, not like that. No. Ten seconds to go before the half. Kentucky down by two. They're going through. They're trying to catch up. Let's see if they can before the half time. Here at the half. It's tied. The score is 52-52 here in Lexington, Kentucky. On this cold, damp day, Eastern Kentucky. Shoots in 3F is what's going into the barrel. We're using a little bit of Swiss Noel B in the pan and Mr. Flintlock lube. That combination works great for Kentucky-style shooting. While the ref's back's turned. I've got this and I'm going to put two balls in it, do a little double ball, and that way I can hit those targets twice, score more points, and I'm going to beat Kentucky. This Cardinal knows how to cheat to win. We'll get him now. Yeah! We're up to five now. Louisville with a technical. UK will get to shoot some free throws to try to catch back up. They're just behind by two. 
Kentucky with the one and one technical foul shots. They've made one. Can they make the second shot? Overtime! Kentucky brought it back. It's 72 all. We're going into an overtime, folks. This is an intense ball game here today. Two threes in a row. We got them up by six. There's no way they're going to catch back up. Kentucky's going to get beat today. We'll be a Cardinals. We'll see about that. Folks, we don't know how this game's going to end. It's went down to the wire. We've got about six seconds to go. Kentucky is behind 114 to 112. Can they shoot the three? Can they make it? Can they win? Yes! Oh, my Cardinals get beat today. Oh, Kentucky does that every time. Oh, man. Oh. I don't know how Kentucky beat us. We tried to cheat. We tried every way in the world to win, like we always try to do. But the Kentucky Wildcats beat us. We gotta hang our hands and go back to Louisville and fire up the bus. <laughs>